Don't forget also, on the 30th of November, I'm going to be on SB Reselling's Sophie's Reselling. Could you call it a podcast interview? I'm going to be on there on the 30th at 7 o'clock, um, which is going to be quite fun. My first ever live chat with someone else. That'd be cool, wouldn't it? So you get to know me a bit deeper um, and how my um, businesses work, which would be quite fun, I think. So 30th of November, I'll be on SB Reselling's channel. Go check that channel out now. I'll put the link in the description for you. Um, Good afternoon. Into Tuesday, it's pretty grey outside. It's been raining all morning, um, which is why I've got the ring light on and the lights on. So hopefully this is going to be clear enough for you guys. Today, box five. Box number five. We've got some good stuff in here. Some River Island, some Lee Cooper, some Billabong jacket. Make sure you stay by, stay tuned. Stay by, stay tuned. Um, I'm going to try something out this week on Thursday night's live show. Whoever comments during the video or during the live stream will be in a chance to win the remaining items that are not sold at the end of the live stream. So make sure you stay tuned, stay good for the chat. Um, so if nothing sells, then whoever wins the live draw will uh, win the whole lot. How's that sound? Probably be a one-off because this stuff um, is going to cost me money, right? But hopefully that brings you some sort of value. Um, um, right, so box five. Should we get cracking, shall we? Let's show you what we've got. Got this cool grey Lee Cooper jumper. It's a size 10. So women's, um, but yeah, a really good nick. Uh, get you a bit close up. There's your label. Um, yeah, size ten Lee Cooper jumper. Up auction on Thursday. Next we have this six silk, made in Turkey, extra large T-shirt. It's kind of white with the. Uh, the six silk logo on a bit and um on the sleeves a slightly different color um i thought that looked pretty cool never heard of six silk before but you have to try these things don't you uh this is the only pair of trousers in here i think yeah these are next a uk size eight um got some Jewels on the uh, buckles and the ringlets and turned up at the bottom. Leg length, you're probably going to be extra short. Um, I'm an extra short leg. Um, in the tag, it doesn't give you the leg length. There you go. Uh, a bit of nice like, dark grey um, jeans. Alright, we're going to pop these two together. These both are River Island. So first up we have uh, a slim fit, dark purple, um, extra extra short. And it's quite, so it's going to be quite a unique niche market there, isn't it? So a nice little pattern on the sleeves and on the whole shirt. Um, yeah, extra extra short. All the buttons are in good nick. So that's that one, and then the other one that's going with it is this extra short River Island sort of. That's the outside at the back. Um, long sleeve. And on the inside, you've got sort of pattern there and the same pattern on the other side. There's the uh, tag extra short. Um, it's almost like a dark blue, bluey grey colour. Right, next 
this billabong jacket medium yeah billabong coat um is it gonna fit me it's too big for me look at that Um, billabong medium jacket um, in really good good condition I think this is probably going to be the winner for the week I think but we shall see shall we that's the inside next this is uh, three t-shirts all music related um, so we have a funny t-shirt it's a it's a medium black t-shirt on it and it says I may look like I'm listening but in my head I'm drumming um, it was picked up for me really but it was too big it's that one and in that set of three you've got a small t-shirt with Jess Glynn on it, a canvas, did I say that was medium, small, and this one is a large, and this one is Bizarre Bazaar, Bizarre Bazaar, from the tour of 5th to the 8th of August 2010, and um, so you got the band on the front, got some slight um, looks like bleach marks there, by the looks of it. Um, and on the back, you've got the tour dates. Were they in the UK? No, they won't. So that's that one. Next, uh, Batman, Lego Batman, age 9. Something like a khaki grey black sleeves can find any other t-shirt or children's stuff in there so this is on its own age nine that's quite cool next i try to kind of shoehorn these two together but you've got um the respawn t-shirt and it's um made by gildan medium um yeah, so the respawn hat helmet. And this one is the Star Wars t shirt, which is also a medium. Almost like an 8 bit uh, Star Wars logo, isn't it? Come out of the way, you've got Darth Vader in the middle and the Stormtroopers on the outside. Right, next. Got Ralph Lauren Large. Pink. And polo shirt. Get a good close up of the stitching. I think this is genuine, but who am I to know? There's your logo. The stitching doesn't look great on there, does it? Um, and there's the main logo. If anyone knows whether this is genuine or not. Right, next, we've got a Jules clothing, kind of like a jump, pink jumper, size 10, got a zip down the back, zip down the back, got um, all sorts of sequin and jewels, not jewels, not actual jewels, um, what do you call them, sequins. All sewn into the collar. I should put those two together, both pink, aren't they? Uh, next, we have this. I get it the right way up. Laura Ashley t shirt, size 12, with a sort of synchronized swimmers on the front, or divers. I thought that's quite unusual. So we put that out, that's up for auction. Um, 
where is it? There's a nice butterfly t-shirt. This is from R and F. Size so 12 to 14 we've put down. There is no size guide on it, but uh, we've put 12 to 14. That might even be a bit bigger than that. Um, there you go, nice mm, butterfly in the front. Next up, we have got FNF. No sizes on the Ivan either. It's quite nice though. It's almost like that's see through that bit. What size is this FNF? Come on. UK 8. UK size 8. Not expecting much of this. This might get bulked in with something else. Probably this one actually. It looks kind of similar. This is an Oasis um, top. Size 8. Yeah, that's a size 8 as well. Yeah, we'll bottle those two together. So we've got the F and F top and the Oasis top. That was a size 8, wasn't it? That was a size 8. If my memory serves me right. Where are you, Tug? So these two are going to go together, both UK Oasis top with kind of like the lace shoulders and then the F and F top black at the back and then on top of the kind of like a lace pattern on the front. Next, <coughs> and I've got like a Cameo Rose, size medium, and we've got all tangled up. We've got all tangled up. Okay, where are we going with this? Where do we need to go with this? This is could be interesting. I'm quite good at untangling things. Right, so this is almost like a. It is a see-through top. Got some arms there, and you've got some frilly bits at the bottom. We've put down medium. Well, it could be a medium, probably a 12 to 14. So, you've got Save the Earth <coughs> blue t shirt. It's a small, a very small. Um, I could probably go with the age nine uh, t shirt that we had. Next, we have got this lovely dress skirt by Oasis from the Fitzwilliam Museum, size 10. It's almost like a mini skirt. It's a bit stretchy, it's a bit stretchy as well. So it's a size 10. This dress is by Miral, size so small. I've never heard of them, but we thought the pattern looked quite good. Um, <coughs> I've got a tickly foot. Next we have the Naf Naf, size small, like a Palm Beach print on the front. Uh, got no sleeves, almost like a vest top. That was a size small. <coughs> What's going on? Now we've got an Armani Exchange size small red t-shirt. Yeah, I thought that was quite cool. Get that out of the way. Armani Exchange. And then lastly, we have got 
Ooh. It's a Miller, Miller London medium. And this could go with that other one, can't it? It could go with this one. Because they're both fairly similar. So Miller London medium, like a like a blouse, open fronted blouse, and this one we're gonna go put those together. There we go. So there we have it. All of box five is empty. Let me put these back. So there we have it, box five, preview for Thursday night. Make sure you get there, eight o'clock we start. Um, yes, how do I finish this off? Yes, right, I have no idea. <laughs> anyway, let me know what you think. Leave a comment in there. Let me know what you think. Make sure you leave a comment down below. Um, if there's anything in there that you'd like before the auction, Go to the eBay store, the link's in the description. Um, try and search for box five or because it's all in the custom SKU. Um, and yeah, if you want to leave a bid, pre-bid before the auction starts, again, leave a comment down below. Make sure you uh, subscribe to the channel to make sure you get notified of when we go live and when I put out new content. Um, so there you have it, box five is previewed. I'll release this again on Thursday morning um, and share out all to the regular social media. If you guys can share it through, that would be great. The more people we get in, the better. And don't forget at the end, if whatever's left over will get drawn for someone who leaves a comment in the chat, um, may win the entire box if no one buys anything. But if you really want something, I suggest you bid, right? <clears throat> there you go. Try something new every week. Come back every week, Thursday, 8 p.m., live auction. See you there.